Hello everyone and welcome back for some more High Queen Kalida in Grimhammer and uh, this episode I think we're gonna take on the Black Pyramid. There's like five armies here and a very strong garrison so we're gonna need some backup from over here. I figured we'll just basically mash these two armies together and send them down here and then use Kalida to basically lightning strike down as many armies as she can. But I don't think she can take down like five armies. So we're gonna have some backups for her. Which we're gonna have to do it a little bit methodically. And also this army is almost done and then we can go and hunt down the final vampire. So let's just pass the turn. Oh and something needed a commandment and yeah I was pretty sure it was over there. Oh and uh, this one has a gold mine. That's the last thing we need before we can start getting all those legions. So I think we'll turn off the taxes over there to have it grow faster. Now we can pass. So Grimgore just broke their non-aggression with, with us. So that's a little bit worrying. But I'm sure it'll be fine. Oh, don't be... You're gonna be like that again. Okay, you know what? Just start walking. And let's can I trade with you now? Or do we have to wait until next turn? I'm guessing we'll have to wait until next turn because Oh, actually it works. Perfect. So this is the guy we want to back up. So let's grab the Ushafti and basically all the skeleton archers. Let's take the Nekarans. And uh ah, that's actually Oh, so, perfect. So, just sending you back over there. You can start recruiting oh, two little guys. And uh, you can be there in like two turns, right? Yeah, I think so. Good. So, we're gonna do some research. And I don't remember if there's any of the Sepulchral Stalkers buff in these. I think there wasn't, right? No. So, we have a lot of vengeance, so we can get some experience, which wouldn't be bad because we do circ like cycle out some of our units sometimes because, well, they do die. And that's pretty okay. Oh, wait, speed and am ammo for Sepulchral Stalkers. That's something we want, right? think so. Yeah, let's get the speed, especially, is really nice. Is it hot? Oh, and uh, right, rise. we're gonna give the bone giant to Kalida as well. And I think we can just grab a spear unit. That's fine. And that was the same turn. But we do have some leveling to do. And you're already immoral, so that's good. Let's finish off banishment. And let's... Uh, evasion is pretty good. And that gives us arcane conduit as well, which is something we really want. So let's go evasion and start working towards arcane conduit. And you. Embalming elixir is pretty good. Oh, wait, we have we have a lot of skill points to use. Good, tomb strike is good. Unless that was this. I think it's called tomb strike. I didn't actually look. And Kalida, to start finishing these. And fate of unit is good to have. This guy. You're just. Getting more charge bonus, because you're just going to drift through infantry, and... No, wait, Tomb Strike is the first one, Desert Strike is the second one, right. And that causes terror, that's sweet. But you're going to get Master Builder. Kimri, can you get up now? No, it was one more, so in four turns. Then we can get a gold mine. And, and pass the turn. So, we're still next to Arkham at some places. So let's send this guy over to Zondri to to protect and let's 
put you in Kemri. Because I don't want to lose Kemri, because that's where we're going to get our golden idols. My will be done. And you can get some some chariots, which is okay. Come on. So. Oh, yeah. Let's start moving in here. Where can you go? You can stand over there, so. Put you there. And we don't actually have that much movement, so let's just go up there close and uh, save our movement for next turn. And then we'll start taking these out one by one. See how many we can get. And then just go back and hang with our two armies. And then just go in for a big old, big old combat. And one more turn. And that will be done. And some research. Is there any more of these we want? The experience is nice. Let's let's get the experience. It will level these up pretty quick. Because is it a thousand they need? I think so. Come on, give me some numbers. Well. It only needs 970 for the next one. So about a thousand. That will start leveling up that army which will make it better against the vampires okay so Kalida is gonna go in and be real sneaky now oh, this is a, there's a lot of infantry that I'm not too worried about but the tomb scorpions and Ushafti is pretty scary but all of these are gonna be pretty good against the scorpions so let's just go for it and I mean, we're absolutely not fighting all of them. They are only getting four armies at once, it seems, but yeah, no. Pyrrhic victory, eh? Oh, and these are gold chevrons. Oof, that is scary, but we'll be fine. Okay, so where do we have their scorpions? They're back here. So... Okay, so... We're gonna want the spares basically right where <laughs> where their uh, scorpions are. We'll put the the Camryon, no, the Hecaron over there. Let's put the tomb guards right there, and let's just put some some of these next to the front line. Let's put two of them back there to shoot over. Actually, put one there, one there. Wrong one, like so. You'll be back there. You're there. You're there. That's fine. You put you there. And we're also gonna grab two of these. And basically, slam them over there. Because they do have stock. Right? They do have stock, right? Hide stock. Yes. Okay, that's fine. Because they're gonna go up behind and take out the Ushapti Great Bows. Because I'm not a fan of fighting Ushapti Great Bows. They do a lot of damage. But we are also gonna have the Bone Giant right here, and they're just gonna target down the Tomb Scorpion as well as they can. This guy is gonna shoot at stuff. This guy is gonna buff all the shooting constructs, which is lots of them. No, wait. There's the neck protect, there's two pins. And that should be fine. Let's put you there. I think that's good. Oh, we should have gambled for more mana, but whatever. You. Start running towards the. the. Ushapti. Oh, what happened here? He could start shooting the the Ushapti, but I think the Tomb Scorpions are actually a bigger threat right now. And you. What are you shooting? Let's take out their archers. That's a pretty good hit. It's 500 damage. Not bad. Some more shots. Ooh, right over the shoulder. Can we get another one? Okay, 
how's your aim, dude? Seriously. Apparently horrible. You get a magic missile off there. Come on. Fine. Get in there and charge. Get some snakes up there. Actually, you start shooting that. And let's do a quick pause here. You shoot that. Just shoot into these. We really need, need them dead. And shoot into the Nekaran warriors because they don't have shields. And you can hang out there. And the Tomb Prince is getting murdered. Let's send you into Skeleton Warriors. Oh, look at you, this guy melting. Okay, let's get this guy in and Tomb Strike. Should be fine, should be able to just... Oh, these guys are hurt. Should be able to get some healing done on that as well. Start shooting into that. Run into those. Oh, why are you on a line like that? I can square up and shoot. Actually, just go in and punch them. Stop them from shooting. You're doing good damage, but you need to kill them faster. And Necrotech. Let's get a heal on those. I shall oh, two prints. Oh yeah, we're doing well. Let's kill these archers. And let's get some. Let's just overcast this and reach. Good. Yeah, you can see these Skulker Stalkers are doing wonders against those. Ushapti, just destroying them, <laughs> and those are running as well as they can. Keep shooting that if you can, go in, kill that, go in there. Kalida, go and kill that. Tomb Prince, go and kill that. And you, please get out of there. Get some snakes in there. My because that, this would have been a horrible loss. And we don't want to lose that. Get a Vortex over there. Just kill that. Make protect. Can't heal that yet. I don't want to cast that on cooldown right now. Oh, and we just destroy that. Uh, heal that. Get in that and kill the spearman. Seriously, how hard can it be? It's just basic spearman. There's not even that many of them anymore. Oh, actually, there are kind of many of them, but whatever. They're all dying now, so it's fine, but we took a lot of damage. But I do think this is this was the strongest one. And the Lord is dead. Perfect. So there's no coming back. Kill him. You did not get that much value, actually. Thought you were going to do better. Thought you would actually actually be able to hit the the, uh, the tomb scorpion but seems like you had some problems with that and seriously I feel like there should be some Benny Hill music to this because they seem to be about the same speed but <laughs> it just wouldn't stop Okay, so bad news, our Legion of the Asp died, so that's unfortunate. That's a thing I, that's kind of annoying with the um, with any undead faction. They don't run away, they just stand there and crumble. But I mean, it makes sense, I guess, but 
It's just nice with other factions that they just run away and you have them for another fight. But, oh well. Let's go for the next one. Oh, and this is a loud ass pyramid. Damn, that's loud. Come on. There we go. So, I guess we're gonna like leave this one out because we can lure their armies out. Because they have a strong ass garrison. So, we don't wanna like save this or this when we fight the the big thing. We wanna leave the small one. It's lightning strike and Peric victory again. This one is smaller but very similar. But yeah, should be about the same kind of fight. Okay. They don't have the tomb scorpions at least, so that's good. We barely have any front line. But I guess we can just use Sepulchre Stalkers as front line. So we do like that. They're pretty good frontline fighters as well. Because they have good stats now. And their charge bonus has gone up from like 10 to 66. <laughs> so that's pretty neat. But let's see. Oh, um, let's get grab two of you. That's going to have to be good enough. No, there we go. Put you like there and the DJ table back there. I am vengeance. And you should be very protected somewhere there. That should be fine. Let's gamble and this time the giant is actually gonna target down the Ushapti. And he's almost in range. So Hurry over there. They're fast as shit now. 113 speed. They're... They're like uh, some kind of... I don't know. Some kind of speed racer. <laughs> I don't know. Look at these guys zooming forward. And they spread out a little bit. Oh, I love them. They're so fast now. Oh, maybe we should have these guys target something good. Don't really... Oh, there's some archers. Let's target that. And are you targeting great bows? I think so. Let's see it. See a shot here. Lining up the shot and... Did we kill two of them? Nice! They're way better at that than shooting at the... Oh, what? It's like you saw me coming. They're way better at that than shooting at the... Uh, at the Tomb Scorpions. And there we go. Beautiful. That's gonna take out most of those units. Oh, and kill that bitch priest. That's fine. Let's Obey me. let's target these guys. Should die quickly. Oh, and these guys doesn't even get there. Awesome. You get over there. Let's get some snakes. And just. Just get in there. Should be able to kill that, no problem. Send you into archers. And have you help with the Ushapti? Oh, and kill that Ushapti. Get out of there. Because this time I actually noticed when it happened. Kalida, you can handle that, right? Come on. Okay, fine. Send in these as well. Come on, get out of there. I don't want to lose you. And this is going fine. This guy is handling stuff. Although, this guy got away. 
shoot them down. And we'll shoot that down too. Realm of yeah, this Ushap is being destroyed by my my snakes. We have two kinds of snakes. Beautiful. Oh, and these are still alive. So, are my archers surviving? Barely. See, this is a problem I have with the Ushapti as well. Like, I get it, they need a powerful ability and all that, but plop them down on their archer. I even caught it right when they did it, pulled them away and sent in some anti-large units and this guy barely survived. Just not a fan. I feel like it's way too easy to just wipe out an entire archer line, especially when we're undead. I mean, normally they would just flee and we'll have to let them re recover and all that, but I don't have that option. Okay. That's acceptable. Let's take that. And we kind of need to take these guys out as well. This is, this is a strong army. So, um, I think we'll have to fill up some units there. The goddess wills the So let's uh like. So break siege so she gets out of the circle. Can you go now? You can. So let's grab some stuff from this guy. And uh we don't necessarily need more archers because we have a lot of ranged stuff anyway. Let's grab Ushapti. I guess the King Nakesh Scorpion Legion and a Green Skull. Alita, right. take the, the last one. And defeat, eh? Hmm. Well, ain't that some shit? I disagree. So, they have two Halberd units and a lot of horsemen. So, I think we'll be fine. Let's see if we can... Let's set up over here. Yeah, you'll get to be on the edge. Let's pull you up further. You're, you're not a lot of units, but you're pretty strong. So, let's... Put you up like so. Put this guy up like so. And I guess you like that. Put one back here to protect this guy. You can probably put you further up. Put you like so. So these guys. We have some Ushap that we can put right there as well. We're gonna cleave down the, the front line. I'm gonna put you over there and try to snipe a uh, horseman. And a boat. Put you there. Tomb Prince. Put you. Actually, let's put everyone over there. And have this guy try to survive over there. Put you closer to. Actually. Put the Scorpion Legion back here. They'll protect from from uh, horsemen, and the the stalkers are just better. I'll put you up a little bit. That's fine. Start. Okay. Let them advance a little bit. Ow! Everyone's got that damn ar arrow ability. At least it's not the Ushap the ability. But, I mean, they got that too, but... Yeah. So. There's a Tomb King, King coming towards us. But... Uh, it's, uh, I guess that's an okay shot. 
Do we have another one? Oops. Oh, some bad camera controls. Let's see. One more. Oh, is he coming? Did that hit? Well, you're doing good damage, so... I guess maybe it is hitting. So, stand still. You have perfect charge defense, right? Well, you have charge defense against large, so good enough. So stand still. Brace. I'll either way. You'll be fine. And, oh, that is the worst possible target you can have. And this is pretty good. It's a nice, sexy arrow attack. With lots of these horsemen. Doing lots of damage. Oh, yeah. That is beautiful. I think we can send you in there. Send you like that, so we plug the hole we have in our in our front line now. And where is their lord? Oh, he went in there. Well, he's dead. So I guess shoot whatever you want. Snakes, bitches! Tomb guards. Yeesh. More tomb guards. Let's send in the Nekarans and send in the Tomb Prince as backup. Maybe we can get some damage on those. But the Ushapti should be pretty good against it, even though like they are pretty good against the Ushapti as well. Let's send you in there. Shoot at that. Shoot at that. Oh, and here's the... Oh, but they put the, the Shafti right in our front line, so yeah, we can kill that. Shoot at that. Get into those... Oh, experiment. Yeesh. And they're not sending anything back there, so send in the Scorpion Legion. Let's get in there. Get you in there. Tomb Guards are bad targets because they have shields. Everything has shields, not those. You can shoot at that. These are dying really quickly. Just send you in there. Should be fine. Yeah, they're, they're falling. Let's pull you out of there. Have you survived in the next battle? And these tomb guards are nice. Shoot that. Every, everything, go after that. Actually, stop. They're crumbling. Just need to hurry that crumbling up. We're fine. Yeah, that wasn't that bad. They were really exaggerating that battle. Like, really? We're gonna lose this? I don't think so. There's some weak-ass predictions they got there. And every time when, <laughs> when I think of how fast these Sepulchre Stalker is, or I don't know why I'm thinking about Speed Racer. But they are so fast. I love them. Well, that was a pretty good fight. The of and we actually appeased. lost these. Huh. Well, I guess that's... I guess we lost 200 of these and 23 of something. Oh. Uh, yeah, tw thir 39. How did I get that 23? That is... That's not even this, the right numbers. 39 from somewhere else. That was a pretty good fight. And they had... All of them had had chevrons as well. Just the Nekaran horsemen had nothing on our Sepulchre Stalker, so... 
Let's grab... Let's just get the I replenishment. We need all the replenishment we can get. And... Let's uh, get you up and close because I think it's time to take down the Black Pyramid because if we use these, just pull these out. This is gonna be a huge battle, so I think we're gonna have to do some other stuff first, like start moving these. Because they are ready for the final vampire fight. And six more turns and we can get this tier five. Let's see, Kemri. Two more turns. You should start recruiting stuff. Let's get a bunch of chariots, I guess. And the horse archers are kind of terrible. But I guess they're better than spearmen. And we have plenty of those. So anything else we need to do? Guess we can upgrade that. And I think we have a lot of upgrading to do here. Yeah, I thought so. Let's see, four turns, and we can upgrade that. Let's get that one. Oh, we should tax that. Oh, how long have we not been taxing that? Let's get that as well. I think we have been avoid taxing the, this since um, since we got the tomb bark, basically. That's a long time. I'm impressed. I forgot about it that <laughs> that long. That's like 40 turns, probably. So let's. Uh... Oh, what? We're missing one. Um, retreat, I guess. Oh, that is too far. Mine will. I have risen. I aim it. I need to be there. Focus. Can I reach? Yes. Okay, now we have three. So, it's gonna be a big fight next episode. Because it's gonna be way too long if we fight this as well. So, let's end the episode here. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, consider leaving a comment and subscribe. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.